good, thugs and thugettes. Welcome to Monday Night in the Pit, the only show where you, the viewer, define the content here on the show. I ask you a topic and then you leave a response in the comments and I pick some of those responses and read them here on Monday Night in the Pit. I'm trying to get as many fresh faces in here as I can. Uh, last week I asked you about the Majestic Map Pack. Sort of a mixed bag of emotions the first half of the week. Everybody is really excited to have small maps and then after a week of playing on it, a lot of the responses shifted towards some uh, critiques, uh, specifically towards some of the weapons settings and sight lines on the maps. So let's check out your responses. Sin City Spartan HD, the Majestic Map Pack is good overall, but the only issue I have is the inclusion of Infinity Slayer on the maps. The reason being there is some imbalance with personal ordnance, ARs, bolt shots, and DMRs. The maps are good, it just depends which game types you have on them. Very true. Pontus Matson, my favorite map is Skyline because I got a killing frenzy on that map. Well, congrats, Pontus. Bayaku Gun 67, my first game in Team Throwdown, I got 46 kills. Nice, a lot of good games so far. The Digster 1-3, I really like the new maps. It's nice to have some more small types of maps and matchmaking. I do think DLC should go back to being compulsory for all but the most basic playlist like in Halo 3 so that I can continue to play them when the DLC playlists eventually die. Very sad about the lack of weapon balancing in the recent patch. Yeah, uh, it's a disappointment that they really just didn't do much with the... The bolt shot nerf. Anyway, we'll talk about that later. Mr. Snowmiser, I have a serious issue with shutout. I don't hate the map. I just hate how small it is for Halo 4's gameplay. And the lighting on it does not do well with the color of the map. It's too shiny for my preference. I think so too, Snowmiser. I've always felt like it need like sunglasses on that map. Official Slayer Bros, honestly, I love Skyline just because it has the amazing view, even though I haven't won a single game in the new playlist. Keep up the good work, BBK. Thanks, Slayer Bros. See where they know. I think the Majestic Map Pack was a great step in the right direction for map style. Better atmosphere and just feels better. But I really hope this gives 343 a perspective on better maps in the future. By the way, need to game with you, man. It's been a while. It has been a while. Everybody, if you guys uh, don't know Arctic, you can go to my channel main page and check out on the playlist on the right. There's Halo CEA uh, Complete Let's Play. We played through the whole thing co-op in the uh, was a really fun time and pretty epic Let's Play, if I remember right. So, uh, XE. The views outside the map are better than the actual maps. Uh, they, they're they really good. I've had a lot of fun on them. I feel like this is what Halo 4 needed as for now. Okay, well, cool. Cool. Good, good. Silly Solomon, only OGs missed that intro. That's right. Only the OGs remember that intro in the first place. And then Doomsday 88. I hope a lot of the extras are toned down in the map pack slash title update. An FPS is a lot like a woman's face. Halo 4 stripped down to its core is a beautiful game, and like a woman's face, a little bit of tastefully applied makeup can hide its flaws and highlight its attributes. But with armor abilities, tactical packages, support upgrades, personal loadouts, and a power weapon for every square foot of the map, the makeup is caked on so thick, it only serves to hide Halo's natural beauty. More isn't always more. Doomsday 8-8, if I had, like, a comment of the week award, you would win that. That is incredible. That sums it up the way, uh, I don't know, my opinions about the map. I've played the maps, excuse me. I've played a few matches. Um, it just seems like there's a lot of ordnance, like, a lot of power weapons already on the map. And then you add infinity settings to it where people can get damage boosts and speed boosts. And it's like you're playing Fiesta Slayer, like, always. <laughs> but I do think it is nice to get small maps i love the sky boxes and they are really gorgeous maps before the video ends here is my new schedule yes i am going on a schedule i'm gonna try my best to stick to this i hope uh it works but i think if it does work this is gonna be a really sweet new schedule so on mondays it is monday night in the pit that's obviously regular and then wednesdays new series coffee break i've been doing two in a row this wednesdays i'm really excited to have a sweet 2v2 gameplay that i'm excited to showcase then friday yes every friday is the new replay review series in fact the announcement video and all the details on how to submit will be coming out this friday so get hyped there i'm also starting to stream regularly and uh the stream schedule will be at the end of the video as well as my new video schedule i'm gonna try and stick to it the way i'm doing my videos now is i'm just gonna try and bust out all the videos in one sitting on a sunday or a saturday and use the scheduled uploader and try and get them out that week what do you want from the next title update and i'm not talking like a little distance nerf to the bolt shot i'd really like to hear some critical feedback as to what you want to see changed in matchmaking think if you were around in halo reach if you guys remember the big halo reach title update that nerfed the bloom 
think along the lines of that. If you could have one big title update to Halo 4, what would you like done to the in-game settings? What do you think needs to be improved? That kind of thing. Don't get too over the top crazy and don't get too long in a, in a comment, but uh, just let me know if there's something that you'd like to see changed. Thanks, you guys. Enjoy the week. I'll see you on Wednesday and Friday. Please don't miss out on the replay review series announcement because once it is announced and submissions go live, um, you got to be pretty quick to get a, a submission in. But it's, it's, it's a little bit different. It's tweaked, so don't worry. Have a good week, guys. I will talk with you later. Cheers.